Good afternoon, Christine. Good afternoon, ma'am. Can you tell us about yourself? My name is Christine Liedo. I'm 42 years old. I have two children. I'm separated. Okay, Christine. Um, I have a few questions for you to answer, so let's start. Yes, ma'am. Why do you want to work as a maid? For my kids to study. Why you choose Malaysia when there is a lot of other country? I have experience in Malaysia, ma'am. How are you qualified for this job? I can cook, ma'am, and I can do my best. May I know what your educational level is? High school level. What was your recent working experience, Christine? In Malaysia, domestic helper. When was that? Since 2014 until 2019. Okay, have you worked other country before? Yes, ma'am, in Singapore. Do you have experience of taking care of babies? Yes, ma'am. Whose base did you take care before? My employer's daughter. How about assisting elderly? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Whose elderly was that? My employer's mother. Do you have any other special skills? No, ma'am. Are you willing to learn new skills? Yes, ma'am. Are you willing to work with a family where the mother-in-law or any relatives stay together? Yes, ma'am. Currently, are you still working right now? No, ma'am. Do you know how to cook? Yes, ma'am. What sort of food can you cook? Philippine food and Chinese basic food. Are you aware that you will have to do washing, cleaning, ironing, and cooking? Yes, ma'am. the house chores that I have mentioned to you, which do you like most? Cleaning, ma'am. If ever you were selected to work here in Malaysia, who will take care of your children? My mother, ma'am. You are not allowed to use handphone during working hours. Yes, ma'am. You are only allowed to use handphone after you finish all the works and when going to bed. Yes, ma'am. You are strictly needed to surrender the handphone to your employer in the morning and your employer will return back to you once you're going to bed. Yes, ma'am. If ever your employer finds out that you're abusing of using your handphone and it's affected your work performance, your employer will confiscate your handphone. Yes, ma'am. Are you agreed to the rules and regulation for the handphone? Agree, ma'am. How many years is the contract as you agreed and understand? Two years, ma'am. Can you describe for me your attitude? I'm quiet and patient, ma'am. How can you assure to us, Christine, that you will work hard in Malaysia? I will finish my contract. Can you promise not to use the telephone without the permission of your employer? Yes, ma'am. Can you promise not to put on makeup but to dress properly while work? Yes, ma'am. Can you promise not to invite friends and relatives without the consent of your employer? Yes, ma'am. Can you promise not to ask for advance salary from your employer under any circumstances? Yes, ma'am. Do you really understand of the rules and regulation of the agency? Yes, ma'am. Do you pay any placement fee for you to come to Malaysia to work as a maid? No, ma'am. Do you have any history of sickness, breast cancer, or any other illness? No, ma'am. Do you suffer from any skin diseases, allergies, or physical defects? No, ma'am. Have you suffered from any serious illness? No, ma'am. Do you smoke? No, ma'am. Have you undergone any operation before? No, ma'am. Are you medically fit or are you fit to work? Fit to work, ma'am. Are you in any medication right now? No, ma'am. Are you allergic with any food? No, ma'am. Are you prepared to work for the employer of different races? Yes, ma'am. Are you prepared to eat the type of food taken or given by your employer? Yes, ma'am. Are you afraid alone in the house? 
No, ma'am. Okay, are you afraid of dogs or other pets? Yes, ma'am. What kind of pets? Dogs. Okay. Can you promise to work according to instruction from your employer? Yes, ma'am. Do you have any family members working in Malaysia? No, ma'am. Okay, we have finished our question section. Let's proceed for case study. I have a case study for you and I want you to respond truthfully. Upon yes, arrival in Malaysia within six months only, in case one of your family members passed away, what will you do? I will send money to them. What will you do to your uh, contract here in Malaysia? I will continue, ma'am. Okay, if in case right now your employer is watching, Christine, what do you want to tell them? Why they need to hire you? Um, ma'am, I can take care of your children and I can do, do a uh, work household work. Okay, tell us about yourself again, Christine. Um, I'm patient and quiet person. And why do you want to work in Malaysia as domestic helper? I like Malaysia. You want to work already... here? Okay. Yes, ma'am. Because you like Malaysia and you have experience. Malaysia. Okay. Um, Christine, yes, anything else you want to tell to your employer? Why the employer needs to hire you? Uh, hire me to can trust me, ma'am. Can I, can I take care of your children? Okay, thank you very much, Christine. We will update to your agency if there is any selection made by the employer. Thank you, ma'am.